It's one of the rare official photographs, actually, we get each year of the three Wales children. Of course, it's an exchange for the media and the paparazzi leaving them alone to get on with a private life at school and, you know, in their downtime, as it were which is, I'm sorry to bring it back to Harry and Meghan, but it is in contrast, and it's a reminder that Harry and Meghan once said one of the reasons they left the UK and the reason they were worried about staying in the UK was for what Harry said was um, they had to offer up their children um, for what they saw as uh, intrusive public consumption. So clearly there's a bit of a contrast here that when was the last time you saw paparazzi shots, for example, of George, Charles or Louis in British newspapers? Mm. The answer is you haven't, and that's what Harry and Meghan have been alluding to. Yeah, it's the first time we've seen the kids, um, I suppose, since the funeral of Her Majesty the Queen. Uh, just the day before she died, we saw the picture of them starting at Lambrook School. It was such a shock, wasn't it? They were all there together as a family. And then Prince William, I think that afternoon or the next day, flying up to Balmoral to be at Her Majesty's bedside. But because this picture was taken in summer, this was actually before all of that. So we have seen the kids since then, but it's a little glimpse back in time. Yes, we have. It's very rare, actually. It was a one-off occasion that we saw them at Lugrave School because it was the first first day of their new school. Of course, they had moved from Kensington Palace to uh, Berkshire uh, uh, near near Windsor Castle. And you're right, this photograph was taken when they were still the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and, and their three children before Her Majesty the Queen passed away. And now, of course, it's the Prince and Princess of Wales. But as you said, Isabel, it's coming the day before the final three episodes of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's Netflix documentary is released. And it looks like, if you read the mirror this morning, there are reports, there are claims in there that Harry is not going to stop with this Netflix documentary. He is in talks with American network CBS to perhaps do a promotional interview for his book, Spare, which is coming out in January with Gail King, who is seen uh, as an ally of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. She went to Meghan's baby shower in 2019, if you remember. Well, Cameron Walker, thanks for lifting the mood on this.